Are you all afraid you're going to like wind up pregnant this weekend or something? I have an IUD. <laughs> I got it in just for the weekend. <laughs> I got what I got. It's not a lot, but I'm rocking it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm in a thong white bikini and a chief set dress. The old days at Foxville Stadium, or Schaefer Stadium, we were younger. Two seconds. Okay, I'm in real quick. Hey. Oh, hi, girls. Hi. How you doing? Hi. Oh, he's my friend. Hi. Hi. Yes, my new sugar daddy. He's married. No, I'm sorry. No, I'm married. He's not married. I'm divorced. I'm divorced. Oh, can I say that to them a little bit? <laughs> His abs are almost as good as mine. Do you want to see him? Get him on cam. FYI, your pubes are showing a little bit. Yes. I, yes, that's that's why. I'll show him more. Didn't you want to like kind of trim up your pubes before you came out to the Super Bowl? Nope. Girls love pubes. We want to party like rock stars, and we love Gronk, and we love the Patriots. That's why we're here. Free drinks, like right? Right, everything. It's all you can eat, all you can drink. Were you at all scared by that? Like, I might drink too much. I'm never scared that I'm gonna drink too much because I always drink too much. <laughs> I know it's in the cards. <laughs> touching your boobs, are they real or not? Yeah, what do you mean? Okay, some people have fake boobs, that's okay. I'm a mom, they're real. <laughs> wait, you're a mom? Single mom! <laughs> so wait, where's your kid? Whitney and I. Okay. <laughs> How did you tell your mom, hey, I'm going to Miami to go to a party and- No, oh, no, I just straight up was like, hey, Gronk's having a party. She's like, go, go, go enjoy yourself. The Patriots. All Boston sports, like, go. <laughs> My kid stayed home from school yesterday. Why, what for? I don't know, he told Nana he didn't want to go. <laughs> well, I live in Miami. Oh, there you go. I love to get drunk, I love to party, so that's why I'm here. How did you two meet? Honestly, we met four years ago. I, I was drunk enough. <laughs> Bad decisions. Bad decisions. And what was that first time like? Uh, it was great until the next morning when he woke up and he said, well, I guess I'm single now. <laughs> Wait, were you dating somebody at the time? Possibly. I mean, I could have been casually dating another woman. Yeah, like three of them. So he was banging three chicks and he hooked up with you, though, which is nice. Yeah. So how long have you guys been married? 32 wonderful years. Very nice. Very nice. Very sweet. And she's fine and she's hot. So you would let Gronk hook up with your girlfriend? Yes. Why? That'd be epic. Would you want to watch or no? I'd have to. I could not. Just to see how it is like, right? Dude, I mean, I'd be like, we might have to break up, but like, that's epic. It'd be an awesome story. I, I, I'd be like, so on the record, I am um, Eskimo Rose with Post Malone. It's my, it's my claim to fame. If you could have a threesome with Gronk and your lady friend, would you would you want to do that? I smack Gronk on the ass, yes, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, we, we have a good time. <laughs> yeah. Threesome, sometimes you touch wieners. It happens. Would you be okay with touching Gronk's wiener? Uh, in the heat of passion. Yeah. Well, I, that, that's something that's uh, in the books. I, I couldn't say that. Right. <laughs> You don't know until you get there, right? Right, right. I'm not going to complain. I wouldn't mind either. So Gronk does have a girlfriend right now. She's like some Sports Illustrated model or something. Oh yeah, she's beautiful. So would you want to hook up and have a threesome with them, is what you're saying? Hell yeah. Why not? <laughs> is that shocking? Would that be your first threesome? Oh man, is this on film? <laughs> 